Alright, so here we have my first PC build. Uh, right now I've got Ponyo playing on Blu-ray. This is one of the things that I added. This is actually kind of a rebuild, but I had to start from scratch. So there's the uh, actual tower. We've got an Antec 1200 case. Um, I added a Antec fan there on the door to blow cold air under the video cards. You can get a look at the inside. We have, as you can see, I set up a Corsair H80 on the CPU, and that is a ASRock Professional Z68 Fatality Board. Uh, 16 gigs of Corsair Vengeance RAM that I have overclocked to 1600 megahertz. Uh, we've got two, I don't know if you can see them, two Radeon HD 6970s, they're both sapphire. Uh, those are just running at standard clocks. The CPU is an i7-2600, not the K, so it's just running at 3.4 gigahertz. Um, got a, you probably can't see it from here, but we have a uh, Seagate 1.5 terabyte uh, drive in there as well, and then we have a Sony, yeah, you probably can't see that, um, that's a Sony black Blu-ray Blu-ray burner, um, 12 times write speed, I think, I'm not sure. Uh, all in all, it took me about four hours, five hours to put together, um, so far, everything's been great. Crossfire is working great. Liquid Cool, uh, I have it set up as an exhaust, so it's taking air from the case and pushing it out. Uh, I did so because the ports for the video cards sit right underneath the radiator, and I felt like at load, uh, you know, all that hot air blowing out of there would just blow up and then get sucked back into the case through the fan, so I set it up as an exhaust. I do get a little bit higher idle temperatures because of that, but my load temperatures are excellent. Um, none of the cores really ever go above like 43 degrees Celsius. Uh, even after playing, you know, Battlefield, um, Skyrim, Crisis 2, whatever you want, so. And there's the Blu-ray playing. That is a Samsung uh, Sync Master, I think. I forget what it's called. It's a 23-inch 1080p, uh, 2 millisecond response time monitor. I kind of want to do dual monitors now that I have the two cards running in Crossfire. But as you can see, I don't really have the desk space for that. So we've got the uh, Razer Naga mouse. Uh, we have an Astromo gamepad, and then I have the Logitech. G510 keyboard, uh, backlit at blue right now. Looks very nice, goes with the case. So, yeah, that is my first build. Um, if you guys have any questions or anything, just put it in the comments. I'm pretty proud of this. Um, for my first build, it was pretty straightforward as far as the hardware installation. The radiator was kind of a pain in the ass just because it's bigger than you would expect. Uh, even though it does line up with a 120 millimeter fan, the actual dimensions of the radiator are larger than that, and so, especially with this case, you can't mount it at the top, you've got to mount it in the middle, and I actually wasn't able to uh, screw in one of the video cards because of that, but it's sitting in there pretty, pretty securely, uh, it latched and everything, so. Cool, well that is it, and as you can see it is pretty loud right now. I have uh, both GPU fans, I run them at a constant 60% fan speed. I have all the case fans turned up all the way. I have the Corsair uh, fans up all the way, and kind of get an idea of the noise coming from it. I mean, it is pretty loud, but I, I don't really care. I wear headphones most of the time, and I get used to it anyway, so... Alright, well that's it. Like I said, if you guys have any questions, just leave them in the comments. Um, I look forward to building something else, but I mean, this probably is going to last me quite a while, so I guess we'll see.